This MLB season, we've seen the good, the bad, and the ugly out of Wrigley Field. But last night, we saw the ultimate display of hashtag teamwork makes the dream work. So in basically the eighth inning, SNY Mets reporter Steve Gelbs got to hang out with fans in the bleacher seats of Wrigley. And the man got the exclusive, no, he got a play-by-play -play on how to make an effective beer snake. And we're going to call this one Beer Snake 101 with Steve Gelbs and friends. Hey, Jake. Can you uh, explain how the cup snake begins? Oh, for sure, Stevie. First off, I want to say hi to my mom, Kelly Johnson, my family, James, Allie, Jim. Love you guys. Basically, the snake starts sixth, seventh inning. Everyone's got a few beverages in. Someone stands up and goes, give me your cups. Give me your cups. You see the snake form up in the beginning. Everyone throws the cups. Now what? What is the eighth inning? Ninth inning? Seven. <laughs> Basically the eighth, Steve. Yeah, and it goes all the way up it goes from the. All the way up, and that's on forms. Pretty simple. Yeah. Now, guys, I have to tell you, this is not as easy as it looks. I have been holding this up for about a half inning, arms killing me. Okay. <laughs> that's a true story. And if you let go, it all breaks apart and everybody boos you. Okay. So this is the bleacher activity out here. All right. First and foremost, I want to say hi to my mom, Beverly London. Hey, Ma. Uh, but let's talk beer snakes. March 8th of 2020, during an XFL game, fans made a beer snake with approximately 1,237 cups. But this one takes the crown. On July of 2021, St. Paul Saints fans and 10,000 takes joined forces and broke the record for largest cup snake in North America with a 102-foot cup snake. That's impressive, but I hope they recycle. 